Good day. What we're going to be doing today is we're going to be looking at a hex hump. Now, a hex hump is a tool for uh, seeing what's happening in a file or uh, across the interface, a network interface. Uh, today, in this case, we're going to be looking at uh, the network interface uh, on my local Ethernet card on my uh, home network. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to enter a capture filter in Wireshark. So Wireshark is going to supply us with our hex dump. So I'm going to put host, and uh, you can probably anticipate which uh, host I'm going to use here. And uh, I'm highlighted on Ethernet UN0. So I'm just going to double click. Now, these windows I don't need anymore. I'm just going to focus on this bottom hex dump window here. And I've zoomed my display so that it's nice and uh, big. And I've also got it the width so that I can see the whole width of the, width of the hex dump. <clears throat> now this is my uh, my terminal window. And I'm going to ping www.cbc.ca. And now Shazam, we see some data in our, in our hex dump. So what we're looking at here stop pinging. Whoops, just stop pinging. There we go. I stopped pinging. So what we're looking at here is uh, we have rows of X data. This row is at offset 0. This row is at offset 10. But if you count, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So 10 is actually um, a hex number that says 116 and uh, zero ones. Here we have two 16s and zero ones. Here we have three 16s and zero ones, and so on. So if we look at the actual um, output here, it's the same thing. So each digit is uh, four bits, and uh, four bits can represent a quantity between zero and 15. So because it's one digit, uh, they start at zero and they go up to F. Okay, so zero to F is zero to zero to fifteen. And then two digits together is eight bits. So if we were to consider this first six bytes here, so these first twelve digits, we got one, two, three, four, five, six bytes. That would be the destination MAC address. Okay, so AE four E three F D zero seventy three C two is my destination MAC address. <clears throat> and then my source MAC address is going to be the next six bytes. So one, two, three, four, five, six bytes takes me to there. Okay, and now if we look, these next bytes, these 0800, zero, zero, you should recognize this, and this should help you to decode the hex dump. So 0800 zero, zero, zero means that we have an IP packet. This is the ether type. So uh, that's kind of exciting, or at least it's kind of exciting to me. I, I see something that I recognize in here, as well as the source, or destination I mean, and the source uh, MAC address through here. So, once we're over the Ethernet header, or the start of the frame, then we start the IP header, so it's nested inside. And uh, the IP header, as you'll probably remember, has a lot of things, um, but at the end, it has uh, some IP addresses. And they're in the opposite order that they were for the MAC address. They're the source and the destination first. So let's go ahead and find the source and destination IP address. The way I do it is I count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And 13 is the start of the 4-byte source IP address. So c 0 a 8 is my source IP address. 
and then my destination IP address is B8 one C C9 26. Okay, and then that's the end of the IP header because the IP header ends with the source and destination IP. So, what is contained here? So, starting on um, offset 20, 21, 22, x22, we have a 0, 08 and a 00. zero. So it'd be nice to know what those what those two bytes mean first two bytes of whatever is contained within the IP packet. So to know what, what the meaning of these bytes are, we need to know what the protocol is. So um, here we had the ether type, um, 0800, there it is. Okay, so the ether type 0800 told us that there was IP starting in here. The protocol we can find by going forward the 13 bytes, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, so there's the um, source IP address. If we go back 1, 2, past the checksum, this is the checksum here, back to here, here's the protocol byte. So the protocol is 1. Um, 4 would be TCP, and 1 is um, ICMP. So what we're looking at here is an ICMP. So if we go 1, 2, 3, 4 bytes for the source, 1, 2, 3, 4 bytes for the destination, here's the start of the ICMP packet. And the ICMP packet starts with a 0, 08, which is an echo request. And then we have a subtype of a zero, 00, which is the way that that works. So what we're seeing then is the echo request from uh, this ping command. 